Um, basically on this one, guys, it's again evaluating us for um, x as, as x approaches um, pi for uh, for a tangent of x. So again, we can look at this and just do applying direct substitution. So therefore, I now need to identify the tangent of pi. Remember that the tangent of any angle is basically equal, and you know, when looking at a triangle, it's um, it's opposite over adjacent, but when we're looking on like the unit circle for coordinate points, it's going to be the y coordinate over the x coordinate. So if we look at the unit circle and we look at the angle pi, starting at our standard position, pi is going to be over here. If here upon the unit circle is 1, comma 0, this point is negative 1, comma 0. So therefore, what we'd have is negative 1 over 0, which is just equal to 0. And that's what you're doing. So you can use the unit circle. You could also look at the graphs. Um, just real quick, if you were to look at what the tangent looks like, you could graph that if you had a graphing calculator available to you. Um, that's at pi halves. That's at 0. Remember, the period is pi. The period is pi. And so at pi, you can see that the graph crosses at 0 if you were to graph it as well. That's another way to evaluate.